wonders shall never end. Like they always say, a drowning man is always looking for anything. I mean anything to just to stand, not to sink. A drowning man. When they were making much, pia, 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 people were warning them. They didn't listen. They didn't listen. I don't understand. They themselves, they want to be deceived. Because of greed, because of what they want to get, it clouds their sense of judgment. David Uma is coming out to tell us now that IPOP is the major cause of the problem he's facing today. The same man who told us that uh, he's working tirelessly to make sure that uh, Namde Kanu is released. And now these people are fighting him. That he shouldn't say glory that does not belong to him. Now he's coming to tell us that uh, IPOP is the cause of his problem. Just like uh, Abakiari told the old world that IPOP members are behind his ordeal. I don't understand whether they were the one who went to collect money on your behalf. They were the one who has been who have been getting all the monies you've been getting from all this illicit business. IPOP are the ones who have been telling you to be arresting people illegally, parading people on, uh, on media trial. All of a sudden, you are making a youth some that they are the ones behind this ordeal. It's just unfortunate the way these people reason, whether they think, you know, because we have a already made mumus that can go with anything, whatever they tell them, they can't even reason it. Ah, why should you tell me this? This is like this, this is like this. How can you say, you know, these things are not really relating. They are not related in the first place. So why are you relating them together? You committed an offense and you are saying a group of people are the ones behind this. I don't understand. But when you were getting the money, you were enjoying it. I'm sure you didn't even give them. All of a sudden, you turn around and tell us that uh, it is the IPOP that are behind your audience. I mean Abakiari. Now, this one is saying the same thing. That the uh, IPOP members are the ones behind his ordeal. You know that uh, Umayi is not a stable person. Just like uh, Oanese, uh, the youth wing of Oanese said, the, all of the things that uh, Umayi has been saying, that they have a archive for that, that they are going to open a book of remembrance to him to see all of the things he has said. And I believe that this man is not a stable, he's not a stable person at all. He's just everywhere. You left a, APC, a PDP to PDP, or you left a, a PDP to APC, saying that uh, the PDP, they have been marginalizing the, the region by not giving them presidential slots. And you made, you went there. Initially, he was denying that uh, that was not the reason why he joined APC. And before now, before then, people, oh my God, I begin to remember now. Before then, when people were carrying these rumors that this man was just in PDP, is a mole in PDP, people didn't believe. And it, it happened to be the chairman of uh, the South East Governors Forum. This old rumor lingered for two years or more than that, that this man is not APC, he's not a PDP man. No. And people say, how come? It's not possible. Not until... When he came out and they come to APC. Now, and I've been asking the question, since he did come to APC, what goodness has he brought to the people? Nothing. People accuse him that uh, he went to APC because of a presidential ambition. He said, no, no, that was not it. But at the end of the day, we began to see that that is the reason. So, it's, not, it's neither here nor there. Oh my, it's neither here nor there. Now, you are coming out to tell us that uh, IPOP is the major cause of the problem you are facing today how he's giving excuses you go and say to yourself they are talking about a uh, what is it called they are talking about a uh, how you took the vote of pdp to apc so you ought to have resigned but you know that everything is a uh, is everything is anyhow in this country and now that has given the zamfara pdp to just as uh, the governor to left the party and went to APC. Now it is an eye opener. Before now, I could remember in uh, those states when uh, this particular this professor Osubo, yes, it was a uh, professor Osubo when he won election against the uh, Oshomole. Then you know before before then, no matter what, if they uh, they said somebody has won, you cannot obtain it. But during Oshomole time, he was able to fight it and. You won, and before you could say Jack Robinsy, and I think that is when this whole issue anybody that uh, has a, any complaint concerning any election or whatever they will just go to court. And um, most of the time, they have been getting success. But 
before then nothing of such but since Oshomole was able to scale through you know everybody any little thing if there's anything that they don't like they were supposed to cause that oh this person is not supposed to be the governor he's not supposed to be on the seat because before then they were not winning but after Oshomole won the case everybody you know have the had the courage to start doing the same thing i think uh, that is uh, what is about to happen since this has happened in a uh, bony state also zamfara state and some of the people are now planning again for uh, the governor of a river a uh, cross river that he did the same thing so definitely they are going to go after him so david uma you should focus on uh, how he's going to get his mandate back if at all if he has a good grants if he has a good case on his hand so that is how it ought to be so coming to tell us that the uh, ipop is the they are the ones behind the ordeal is so so pathetic and so unfortunate like i said from the beginning a drowning man will want to hold anything even <laughs> a pin he wants to hold what will pin do what what will a tread do that you want to hold so that you're not drowned no he's not going to help you in the first place these are just a uh, lame excuses that do not hold water. They do not hold water. Okay. How? 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 People are asking. How? How did they? How is it that they are the cause of this? Uh, your problem. How? It's it's just unfortunate. In what way are you insensitive? Hmm? You know they can say anything. Now, so it is possible. They can say anything. They can do and undo. But I don't know who is going to save him more. I learned that he has gone to hire 18 sons, sons senior advocates of Nigeria. Yeah. And people are asking, whose money is going to is he going to be using to do that? Is it still the same taxpayers' money? These are the people they will tell you that yeah, before the foundation of this world, before the creation of this world, before they were born, even before when, why they were why they were in their mother's womb that they were billionaires. You begin to ask yourself, how what did they do in the first place? What did they do? If they have a uh, little changes like this, uh, they will not tell you that. Say, I have been a billionaire. I, 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 I was a philanthropist before, before I became governor, before I became minister, before I became this, before I became that. So whose money is he going to be using for that 18 cents? Because those ones are not cheap. They are not cheap at all. Let's see where all this their drama, where it will lead to. But for you to come out and make it a U-turn and be telling us that uh, it is high hope that uh, they are the cause of the problem you are facing. It, it shows that uh, you guys are, uh, are shameless. You guys are really shameless. So guys, uh, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this. Thank you.